Hey there, I'm Alex, and today we're going to be checking out three AI note takers for your future Google Meet meetings. The first one is going to be Firefly's AI. The second one will be Blue Dot, and the third one will be read.ai. So without any further ado, let's jump right into the video. So Firefly's AI, this is what it looks like on the homepage. You can see that in the middle over here, I have all of my past meetings. And on the left side, I have a bunch of tabs that we're going to be checking out later. Now, what we're going to be checking out right now is the Google Calendar integration. So here on the bottom right, you can see that my Google Calendar automatically syncs with Fireflies.ai. So whatever Google Meet meeting I have running, for example, I have one at 1015, the bot will automatically join and record this meeting. So all I have to do to join the meeting is click open meeting right over here. And as you guys can see, I have some people that are waiting. Now, what Fireflies.ai does is it will send a bot to record your meeting. And so in the waiting room, you can see that the Fireflies.ai note taker bot is in there. And all I have to do is click admit and there you go. The bot is currently recording the meeting. And so back on the fireflies.ai page, you can see that the meeting is going, it's live and it's recording. It's happening right now. And I could click the purple button that says live meeting. And here I could see the meeting timer and how long it's being recorded for. Now, one interesting thing that some people may find as a downside is that fireflies.ai is only able to record meetings with a minimum running time of three minutes. And so I'm going to have to speak for three minutes or be in that Google Meet meeting for three minutes to make sure that my transcription does get run through. Now, while we're at it over here, you can see that I can add some important stars, some action items. I could click a positive or a negative feedback within my meeting. And so here it kind of gets you to keep track of your meeting activities in real time. And so jumping back to Google Meet, I'm doing my talking, doing my interview, my sales meeting, and I have other participants in the meeting. Now, as you guys can see, Fireflies.ai's bot does show up as a participant. And some may find that as a downside because they'd have to explain to all of their participants what's going on why the bot is in here and so forth. And so there you go. It's been three minutes since my meeting has been recorded. And so all I have to do over here is click the stop button and you will see that the meeting has successfully ended. Now, one thing is that Fireflies.ai's bot does take some time to leave the meeting. And so here I am. Meeting is already done, as you guys can see, but Fireflies.ai is still in there. So that's a downside, it does not leave instantly. And so here you go, back on the page, you can see that my test meeting has finished transcribing and there you go, I have it right over here. On the right side, I have my transcription itself, the whole recording, whatever I said. Now, some may find that Fireflies.ai transcription is not completely accurate. For example, there was only one speaker being myself in the meeting and here it detected two speakers. You can see that where I said Fireflies.ai, it only put Fireflies space AI and then it put a dot and then moved on to the next speaker and then started off in the middle of my previous sentence a brand new paragraph. So some may find that the transcription could have some few downsides but overall it just kind of gives you some timestamps, all the speakers involved and just a whole transcription of what happened in the meeting. On the middle you could see the whole overview, what I talked about, a few notes and a few key points with timestamps that you'd like to keep track of. Now at the bottom there are some action items and again with timestamps which is very useful. On the left you could see some filters, some sentiments, if the whole meeting overall was neutral, positive or negative, the speaker talk time and so forth. Now, Fireflies AI has been on the market for a very long time and thanks to that, they have a lot of integrations. Now here on the left, you can see some of their integrations, some of them being email, Google Docs, Google Meet, Microsoft Teams, Notion, Skype, Zoom, and so forth, which is pretty useful. And so our second AI note taker 
blue dot. Once you add it from the Chrome Web Store, this is what it looks like on the home page. Now, once you pin the extension, all you have to do is come over here to the blue dot on the top right and click start capture. And it's that simple. See that little check mark? My meeting is being recorded. On the bottom, you can see that it is active. But did you notice something? There is no bot in my meeting. Yes, Blue Dot is bot free. So with that being said, there's no minimum time of recording like Fireflies to receive your transcription. And it just works in the background. It records and it does its thing, which is really, really sweet. Now, all I have to do once I'm done recording is click the hang up button. I'll leave the call and what will happen? A new tab pops up. Now in this new tab, I have the video recording. I have my transcript that's processing as well as my general notes. And so here you go. This is the transcript itself. You can see that it accurately talked about everything. And see right over here, I can literally highlight these parts over here. I could highlight the sentence and then I could clip it or I could copy the text, which is really, really sweet. I could also run the video recording and it'll highlight where I'm talking in the transcript on the video recording. I could also scroll through the video recording and it'll scroll through the transcript, which is really nice. On the bottom over here, you have a general overview of what the meeting talked about, a few action items. On the right side, you have some insights and you could also add some comments. So I'll give you guys a real life example of one of my old meetings that I did. And so to do so, I'm going to come on the left where it says meetings. And here I'm going to have all of the meetings that I recorded. So let's say I'm going to go to this one over here. And here you can see that I had a meeting with a few of my buddies about an upcoming trip of theirs and it gave me some of the action items. It gives me some of the highlights of the meetings and so forth. Here I could see the insights, who talked the most, some few interactions, talking speeds, how many questions were asked. So it's a very, very useful tool for your meetings. I really love it. I use it whenever I hop onto Google Meet. And one feature that I really appreciate is generate AI email right here on the top right. If I'd like to give a follow up email to my coworkers, my friends, whoever it is, all I have to do is right over here, meeting, meeting, email, it's in there. It's amazing. It makes me happy. So this is a tool that really helps you streamline your whole workflow, makes things easier. And this email feature really helps you not remember what happened in the meeting. Cause for me personally, I find that it could be hard. All I have to do is generate AI me email and it's right there. So now we're going to explore the blue dot page itself on the home. You can see all of your meetings on the top row on the second row. Blue dot was very kind to us by giving us a kind of demo of how the whole software works, it shows you how to record your screen, how to generate those email follow ups and just a blue dot introduction, a demo and so forth. Now here on the updates tab, you can see the activity. So once your meetings are done being uploaded and they're ready to watch, you will be able to get notified right in here. You also have some of the screen recordings. So blue dot can also screen record as an example, you could click that blue dot and it says recording screen. And all I have to do is start recording. Once I end it, it'll show up right there. And as I mentioned previously, meetings right over here. So blue dot, very straightforward tool, very clean approach, bot free works awesome. So the last and final tool for today is read.ai. You can see that I have it right over here, the calendar tab, and it automatically syncs with my Google calendar, just as fireflies.ai did. And I have a meeting that's happening right now. So if I jump right into the meeting, you can see that read.ai is in the waiting room and it is waiting to join my meeting. So all I have to do is click admit and there you go. Read.ai is currently recording my meeting. It's doing its thing. I'm talking and so forth. And so once again, just as fireflies.ai, it's working in the background recording the meeting, but you could still have a participant ask, Hey, why is this thing called read.ai inside my meeting? What's happening? And some may find it as a downside that you need to admit a bot, wait for it and, you know, explain to your participants what's happening. But anyways, that's that. Once I am done recording, all I could do is I could click remove from the call or I could also just click the hang up button. And so here you go. The report is now available on read.ai test meeting 
right over here. Click it and you can see that the video recording is here on the right. I could scroll through it. I could also adjust the playback speed. And here you have the whole recap. So if the meeting was obviously a little longer, you would have a summary of the meeting like an overview like we saw in Blue Dot. You would also have some chapters, some topics, some action items, but that just kind of gives you an idea of the look. Over here, you could have the whole transcript as you can see, and the transcript, it seems fine. Um, you could see that, for example, read.ai is not capitalized, although it is a word of a company, but overall, I feel like the punctuation as well as, you know, the question marks and so far is properly placed. So overall, good transcript. You could also deep dive and you can see some of those sentiments that read.ai does offer. So you can see that it can sense the attitude towards the meeting based on audio cues. It could sense how positively or negatively others reacted. And overall, there's just a lot of nice sentiment data that you could have. It gives you a score between 50 being bad and 100 being good. It gives you also the average. And overall, if you're really interested in that data, you have it all here. I find it pretty cool, pretty interesting. And here on coaching, you can see the talking pace, how quick I spoke and so forth. So overall, there are a few tabs that you need to scroll through and some things that you need to get used to. And so overall, that's read.ai for you guys. I feel like if you get used to the tool, it could be a very powerful one. Now, before ending this all off, we're going to talk about pricing. Fireflies.ai starts free forever. Now, there are a few downsides to that. For example, you can see the minutes of storage for the free. You only have 800 minutes for the pro that starts at $10. You have 8,000. Now, let's say you needed unlimited. You could pay the business for $19, which would be unlimited. And if you're a large scale enterprise, you could do $39 with all of the unlimited features. Moving on to Blue Dot, you could stay free forever. It's the ideal way to get started for $0. You can have five meetings in that little plan and your max recording time is one hour. For the basic plan, you have $14 a month. Unlimited recordings, you still have that max one hour per recording. But if you'd like to one up a notch, which is recommended for lots of the pro users, $20 a month, unlimited meetings, unlimited durations, lots of integrations, Zoom and Google Drive import and so forth. And if you're a large scale business, you could do $32 Per month and you have everything and anything and last but not least read.ai free for zero dollars and again just as blue dot you only have those five meeting recordings and for pro if you'd like unlimited meeting recordings you could pay 15 dollars but then you move on to enterprise and here you have some highlight reels so you could watch a few recaps if you'd like a better insight of what happened during your meeting and you could also move on to enterprise but the plus version for 29.75 so basically $30 and here you basically once again have everything and anything and those are for the organizations that need for example more security control as well as support with read.ai. And so that was it guys. This was a little overview and review of Fireflies.ai, Blue Dot, and Read.ai. Let us know in the comment section down below which one was your favorite and which one you might start using. Like this video if you found it helpful and informative. And until then, subscribe to stay up to date with our future uploads. See you guys in the next one. Thanks for stopping by.